I built the first breadboard version of the EQ back in December 2020. I had several discussions with my son Guy and his son Max. He lectures in audio technology at uh, Chichester University. They were particularly interested in the control of, of near supersonic frequencies. So I came up with an original design with a, a super high band on top of the normal four bands that you usually get in, uh, in parametric EQs. The experiment worked, worked okay, worked very well. So I pressed on with the complete design, mainly as a replacement for my earlier EQ, the, the P9. That was an inductor-based design, very old-fashioned and very, very expensive to make. The P82 is, is based on a series of electronic inductors which set the frequencies. The frequencies are selected by six-way switches and the amounts of lift and cut and the various frequencies are, um, are set with those lovely old chicken head control knobs mounted on some special pots that I had made for me. They're stepped and they can be set to any of 19 positions so that the, uh, the settings that you had that, that they were set to before, you can, you can find them again. The, the P82 EQ is designed really for fine control of frequency response, so it's almost impossible to give any sort of realistic demo in a short video. You really have to try it on a good monitoring system. <laughs> 